I never thought I'd find myself in Switzerland, but after watching Crash Landing on You, I just had to go. Like, I can't believe that people actually live in a country where you see this every single day. And I don't mean to romanticize it, because people have said bad things about Switzerland as well. But honestly, my dream is just working on a farm and sitting at the top of the mountain for the rest of my life. And for real, the groceries here are insanely expensive. These are the beautiful houses you'll see all over Instagram, and we're actually staying in one of them today. It's such a cool vibe compared to a hotel. I didn't have many expectations for the bridge, but going on there is incredible. You get an incredible view of the lake, the mountains, the sun, everything. Like, it's so surreal, and seeing this long bridge end-to-end, -end, walking across it, listening to the soundtrack, was my most favorite thing to do. Like, I would propose on this bridge, so I should probably gatekeep the location, but I want you guys to go. Then you can get lost anywhere and just admire the silence, the peacefulness, and the quietness. Even though I'm a loud and noisy person, I love to just pop in some headphones and just walk around. Switzerland is your own therapy. We followed some random trail, and it kind of got scary. There was absolutely no lights and no one. Like, this literally looks like a horror movie, and I was honestly so scared walking through this for like 30 minutes and i don't know how my friend was not scared at all once we got home i realized i left my toothbrush at the last hotel and everything was closed so i literally just brushed my teeth with my fingers and always check if there's no bed bugs and that was the end of a beautiful day in switzerland